What's up, divas and divos? So it's your girls, April and Momsy. And we are back for another Dollar Tree haul. So this month is April. Yep, this month is my month. It's April. And we don't really do the Dollar Tree hauls like that as often because, listen, I'm not trying to spend all my money at the Dollar Tree. And second, Mumsy's just too busy for me. She got her own channel. She, you know, she doesn't really want to be bothered with me like that anymore. So she's a little bit too busy. I'm not saying that. It's just that I won't be in the mood to. Sometimes. What's up, Divas and Divos? It's your girl, April and Mumsy. And we are back to do a Dollar Store haul. Dollar Tree haul. Yeah, same thing. Fabric. I'll pull your heartstrings brick by brick. Make you love me. Hey, girl, let me build you up. Play an optimist, let me fill you up. Hey, girl, this is definitely love. Hey, girl, let me build you up. Play an optimist, let me fill your cup. Hey, girl, this is definitely love. Brick by brick. brick by I'm going to have a, like a meet and greet at the Dollar Tree. What do you think about that? No. Why? Everybody knows that's where they could find me at the Dollar Tree. Because of the store. People are trying to shop there. Oh, but we'll just close it down for like the day and just have a meet and greet at the Dollar Tree. But what do other people need to get things? They can go to the other Dollar Trees. Not my problem. <sighs> So the first thing we're going to show you guys is the stuff from the 99 cents only store. So I didn't get a lot of stuff. Um, some of the things that I did get was just like household cleaning stuff. Um, I love to go there um, for the, um, what is it? Like the Arm & Hammer. I think it's Arm & Hammer. Yeah, the Arm & Hammer, Hammer rug um, cleaner, like the rug sprinkle deodorizer. They have like different scents opposed to the Dollar Tree. They only have like a one cent. So I like to go there for that and like some other things too. But I thought this was so cute at the 99 cents only store. It's just a glass heart. You can hang it, you know what I mean, on the wall. And it just says Dream Bay with some glitter on it. This I got from Mumsy for her room and they don't really be packing stuff nicely at the dot like at the 99 cent store like they do at the Dollar Tree. They don't wrap it. Yeah, they don't wrap it exactly. They just throw it in a bag. At the Dollar Tree, they wrap your stuff. So this is all cracked and stuff. I should just bring it back and be like, excuse me, but hello. It got a little princess crown on it, and now it's all cracked and stuff. Yeah. Also, I did get these, which are really cute. These are cute because you can put like little things on them, like your jewelry, your rings. You can even put them in the kitchen and put like your spoons on them and stuff. This one says, "It's a beautiful day." What should that say? Good vibes only. Good vibes only. Okay. So they were ninety nine cents. Super duper cute. Um, they did have like a variety of colors. Um, pink, white, like an aqua blue or mint greenish blue, whatever. And each one of them had like different sayings on them. Some had stuff about coffee. I don't drink coffee, so that wasn't really anything for me. But I thought these were cute for my kitchen. But I thought this was super cute just to put, you know, on the counter space, put a spoon on it. Because you know what I can't stand? too big. Mm -mm. A spoon, one spoon. Just when you're cooking, I can't stand like if somebody cooking in it mixing up stuff and then they just put it on the stove or the counter and it gets all dirty so i like to have stuff where you could sit it on so these i thought were really really cute for that so you guys know how i feel about the 99 cents only store in the electronics section i stay getting some earbuds for the kids not because they're garbage just because they lose them or they leave them around and if somebody ends up stepping on them or they break them but for the most part these work really good um i like these at the 99 cent store way better than the ones at the dollar tree because they have like a better variety like they have some at the 99 cents only store that have a mic so they're mic enabled and they work the ones at the dollar tree that have the mic they don't work okay and plus the quality of the ones at the 99 cent store are actually much better Plus also the electronics, like the six pin charging cables. This one here is for like the iPhones or like, you know, any type of Mac product. This is a six pin charging one. These work a lot better than the ones at the actual Dollar Tree. Like they last longer. Um, and this is just the high speed ones. Um, you always have to look on the actual packaging with either store and see if they're high speed or just um, data charging because some of them do take longer. So I would definitely say to um, check and make sure that 
they are strong enough to you know charge but on the back it also says compatible with iPhones no data transfer so you can't transfer your like your pictures and stuff like that with it oh. moving on to the Dollar Tree we got a bunch of stuff it's more or less like a collective haul we took a time to get the stuff they had some really really cool stuff at the Dollar Tree I was so amazed and do we have to go there today for something no we have to go to Sam's Club no I gotta get some toothpaste oh. we can go to the 99 cents only store right next door down the street from the Sam's Club maybe I'll bring this heart back feel like y'all broke and the other, and the other stuff for Sam's yeah Club. feel like y'all broke my heart that was funny right um it was corny. It was corny? Yes. No, to the Dollar Tree. So I'm I'm a very organized person. Sometimes I might be a little bit messy, but I'm definitely organized. I like stuff to be in its proper place. And what better place to go to get organized baskets, buckets, um, these things. I forgot what the name of these are called. But listen. No, Tati called it something. I can't remember what it's called. But I'm pretty sure that somebody will tell me what it's called because I just had like a brain freeze. So... I totally forgot. So for one, I hate to see I hate to see people's jackets and stuff all over the place thrown on my chairs and stuff. Like, go hang up your jacket, please. Go hang up your jacket. <laughs> these are the door hangers um, over the door hooks. For one, I like these ones because there are the ones that you have to actually screw in the wall. I'm not like a huge fan of those because it can actually weaken the wall. And you can't put butt so much on it, but these that you could just hook onto the back of onto your door are great for coats, towels, and all kind of stuff. So these are actually really, really good. I did get two of so these. I because, think that this is what I'm calling it. Um, it is a a caddy, a tote caddy. So that is for my bathroom. I got that for my bathroom. I thought this would be cute because my toilet is in its own separate like location, has its own little room, and you can put like your feminine products in it and separate it. Instead of keeping everything in a box, I have like this big um kind of like ledge behind the toilet where I can put stuff, put like, you know, feminine products in um, tampons or pads, you know, take them out the box and things like that. Also, these two right here, I love these baskets. You can do loads of different things with them, but this will be just for like my cleaning supplies that I keep in my bathroom or um, air fresheners and things like that. You can definitely store these in them. I just like everything to be in its own place. And so this is another basket, which is cool. I'm probably going to keep it this color. This is just to put on my table um, where I have like the mail at in my house when you first come in. This would be cute, a nice, it's a nice basket to put the mail in so that way it doesn't get overwhelmed and just gets thrown all over the place because I cannot stand for stuff to be not so neat. And then after a while, I'll throw it in the garbage, you know what I mean? So these, I like these because they come with lids, but not this particular size. There's only one particular size that comes with the lid. And what did I do with the ones that came with the lid? Spray paint them and put them in the living room and put your stuff in it. Spray paint them gold. So you wouldn't even know that there was a dollar. You know what I'm saying? put toilet paper in there and like hang up in your bathroom. Dang, your toilet paper gonna fit in here, girl? Yes. The toilet paper roll is too long. Why? It's too wide. You need the other basket for that. This one, you mean? This? No, not that nah, one. No, that's for the mail. Oh. Yeah, girl. These are dumb cute. We'll take them. Why do you even try those? Because they're three, you know what? They're for your room. These are ugly. No, they're not. <laughs> they're not ugly. I don't that one have in that one in what? I would rather have the white bins. Okay, I got all of them. She's so okay. So anyway, Dollar Tree got some really cute new stuff, and they got these reversible sequin bins. Okay, so there were three different colors. Show it off, girl. Show it off. And there were three different colors and three different designs. If you go to Walmart, you know how much these are at Walmart. They are five dollars. So for a dollar. You're not even saying it like you mean it. <laughs> Say it like you want to. For a dollar. Make me holla. Right. Because sheesh. So, I mean, I'm saying for a dollar, make me holla. Why you don't like this one? Put anything in there. Listen. Oh, my God. Listen, <laughs> Linda. Listen. First of all, you don't have to. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. First of all, you don't have to fit everything in it. It's cute. You put them on a shelf and you put little things in them. Okay. These are a so shelf. cute. You're going to have a shelf. You're going to make your room look My nice. Shelf is, what, how is this going to fit on a shelf? 
What do you mean? Well, how's it going to put it on a shelf? A shelf is skinny. No, they're not. Well, some they're, they're shelves not. are. <laughs> Anyways, for a dollar. Make me holla. Okay? They're cute. Because if you go to Walmart, you're seeing them for five bucks. And they're reversible. Show them how they do it. How you do it. You take the sequins. You're not even doing it like I you care. care. <laughs> oh, God. She doesn't even... Look, and now it's pink. See? That's cute. You said you wanted this color one. Yeah, I thought you meant for your room. No, for yours. Why would I put this in my uh, room? Because uh, <laughs> you do it. It was... I'm buying collecting stuff for your room. You cannot pass up this deal. This one is super cute. This this size is um. They're like I said. There's three different ones. So this one is okay. Well, show it off. They're all different sizes. You have to look at the dimensions. So they all may stay the same dimensions, and but some may be the same dimensions, but made a little bit shaped differently. But they're all the same dimensions. Little girls love stuff like that, right? Well, you said you wanted this one. See, this is one that's wider. Okay, yeah, see, they're all different. Okay, so that one is really pretty. I like this one better. So let's see, what what was it before? Okay, I'm not show sure. Okay, well, they didn't even get to see the gold. Oh, sorry. She'll show you in a second. So look, see, they're the different dimensions. So see, this one is, they're same dimension sizes, but made differently, different shapes. So that one is light pink and silver and gold, okay? You picked this one out in the store. Yeah, because I told you you wanted it for your room. Oh, so pick... So you just said that this one was ugly. So then you want me to have no, the ugly one? Wait, I'm not saying that. I got you. I, I got just thought you wanted it for your room so you could put it under your desk. Well, and I wonder if I'm gonna put it in it. here. Your stuff. I your, got enough junk. Store your little Dollar Tree stuff in there that you this don't use. I'm just trying to play shade on me. Talk about the Dollar Tree stuff that you don't use. And then we got the other color, which is the black and silver. Show it off, girl. Oh, I think I'm sorry. This is what I'm talking about. That's why she's got her own channel. So this is the black and silver one. That's cute. See? Yeah, this one's cuter. This one's cute. I mean, that one's okay. They're all cute. <laughs> this is so rude. Like, look, look at that. Show that off. Isn't it adorable? Like that is the black one, and it has that's pink, and it holds it. Ready? pink and silver sequins so i think these are adorable for five for a dollar like i said if you go to walmart these things are five dollars and i was so tempted like when they first came out of walmart to get them but then i was like i ain't about to spend no five dollars on this please they're cute and all but i don't need everything that's real cute but for a dollar make me holler definitely will buy them all give them for gifts so happy birthday it's not my birthday yet it's, it's an early I birthday wanted. gift she wanted it she's lying i did not also they came out with these gold plates last month i think it was like during easter right mm -hmm. and i had wanted them and then mumsy was like what do you need them for and i was like i'm gonna change the dining room plate and she was like you don't need them your dining room table looks nice already and then i was like all right i just went along with what she said and they were plastic anyway but they were really really cute you wouldn't even know that they were plastic but they were a dollar a piece but they were cute but there was this hard plastic that you know you wouldn't even know then i was there i think it was yesterday yesterday Mumsy wasn't around. They had the silver ones. Yes, my so bought them. So I bought them. Yeah. They super cute. You like them though. So I want to have to tell you now. But you said that these would look really, yeah. really nice. I bought six of them because I'm just going to incorporate them into my, you know, dining room stuff. Because it's silver in there. So, and um, it just, it's going to match. Okay. Look at that. It gives us like some reflective light. Look at that. You can probably make something really cute with this light. Let me see. You could like make something like glue something. I don't know. Like make try get some googly eyes and hang them on my wall. No. Okay. <laughs> that would be that would be too cute. Like yeah. <laughs> no, like make like some type of design on the wall. Cause I don't know. I have this thing for circles. And like I don't know. I don't know, girl. I might have to make something with this. See, that's why I should have got the gold ones, because I could have incorporated just like that circle thing that I made in the in the dynamo and it was gold and silver that I spray painted it. You know what I'm talking about, right? I have the tutorial here. I could have did that with this, like another one. See, Tati, she liked my thing. See? You see what I'm saying? Our mumsy's throwing the shade. We just not gonna pay her no mind. But the Dollar Tree got some cute stuff. So look, see what I'm talking about with yeah, the headphones? It's just headphones. I know. I'm about to show. Mm -hmm. 
They these ones are cute. They're decent, but I like I said, the ones at the 99 cent store are definitely a lot better. But if you don't have a 99 cent only store, you can definitely get them from the Dollar Tree because they're just as good. So we got three pair. I mean, I stay stocked up on these just because the kids will be like, oh, you got some more headphones, can't find mine. So, you know. They also had the ring holds for your phone. And mine is so funny because I had one on the back of my phone, but the ring part broke off. So I got another one. Um, this one is from the Dollar Tree. I'm not really sure how good the actual tape is going to be for it. They ain't selling no pop sockets at the Dollar Tree, girl. The ring is stiff. And it had red and white, and it just so happened that it came right in the nick of time. So I'm definitely hoping that the back of this is as strong as the back of this right here. Um, I did get some class-free flat elastic bands. These are 15 in a pack, and these are a little bit wider. There are thinner ones and wider ones and wider wide ones, huh? No glow-in-the-dark. Yeah, glow-in-the-dark ones? You didn't get them. You don't, you don't uh, want the glow-in-the-dark? You don't want the glow-in-the-dark people? No. No, John Aya. I don't. <laughs> The thinner ones like Mumsy has in her hand, the um the headbands, I like those to wrap on a ponytail, um like a Mumsy's ponytail, or whatever. Those are really good for that. They have, have um wider ones, and those come twelve in a pack. Girl, you will pop yourself in the eye. One the other day, I was doing this video, and I was showing one of them off. That thing popped in half. Girl, I was like, for real. Mumsy spotted these, and they were so cute. Um, I don't know how long they've been selling this, but my son Wuzzle, he likes to take salad. Of the, yeah, of at the, the crappy place. Dollar Tree. Uh, uh, they probably got these at the good Dollar Tree, too. I wouldn't even put it past them, but my son was would love to take salad to work. And then he always put, like, the salad dressing in, like, a Tupperware, you know, because you're not about to take my Caesar dressing to work with you. But these are cute. This is the travel dressing container. This is enough for one dressing, okay, one salad. Like, for real, like, don't get carried away with the seeds of dressing, not for me. So we got two of them. Another new product that everybody is going crazy over, girl, okay? You ready? No. Okay, well, for a dollar. What is it? Oh, make me holla. We're going to do this again. That's right. Okay. For a dollar. Make me holla. Bam. 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 Uh, this is the I'm a pet. Uh, I'm a ped, what I have with me said, I'm a petty, perfect. You ever see these in the commercial? They'd be like, I'm a petty. Do your feet and stuff and your nails? Well, they're 18 bucks at Walmart, okay? They had these at the Dollar Tree. These are the petty perfects. You could do your toes. Um, I do believe you can do your nails with them. Yeah, shiny nails effortlessly. Effortlessly, okay? Three refills. You need a double A battery, just one. And girl, hook it up. So I'm going to hook it up for myself. But there's $18 at Walmart. I bought a couple of them, sent one out for a gift. Like, look, you hook yourself up, girl. You hook yourself up. I just don't get it. <laughs> it's for you know how people like their nails to look all cute yeah, and stuff. Nail polish. No, that's that ain't the nail polish ain't included, home girl. <laughs> I just really get it. It's to make your nails look nice. Don't you want your nails to look just, nice? He's a flyer. A, a what? These things to shave them down. Yeah, but you got a little machine that does does all that for you. This was at the Dollar Tree. It's normally eighteen dollars at Walmart. Listen, like, wait a minute. Is this the real brand? Because I could not believe it, and it's new. It's new. It yeah. just came out. Okay. She doesn't. Care. So Bolero has a hand wash now. I thought this was cute. I tried to show it to Munzi yesterday. She was just like, "It's just hand wash." I thought it was cute. I mean, it's a cute shape. That's what I meant. Like, it's a cute shape. I just poke my face right. out with that. Dang, girl. <laughs> So what is the scent of it? Let's see. Turn it around. It's honeysuckle and green tea. And I thought, show the bottle off, girl. The bottle was so cute. They did have some new oils and stuff and soaps and new bath bombs. But I don't mess with the bath bombs because they don't really fizz up, do they? No. But so, probably not. See, look. Mumsy's, Mumsy is real about it. She would tell you. It's like for all those hauls people was doing like, oh, yes, the bath bombs. They don't, they don't fizz bath up. Bath bombs. Said bath bath bombs. bombs. I said bath bombs. No, no, I said bath bombs. <laughs> oh, I said bath bombs. Uh, she would tell you they did not fizz up, okay? So just avoid those at the Dollar Tree. But I thought that was super cute because I like the shape. And who don't need hand soap? Does it smell good? Yeah, it smells okay. 
Also, I wanted to try this out. This is also from the Dollar Tree. This is the Silk Silkens. Silken's Salon Series. They do have the shampoo, the deep condition, the, con um, the one that's mixed with the shampoo, the conditioner, shampoo mixed together. This is damage repair conditioner with soy protein and essential amino acids. I heard that this was actually a good conditioner. I didn't get the shampoo, which I should have, so I may go back and get that, but you get a nice size bottle. As for the scent of it, so let's see. It does smell really good, though. It smells familiar, though. This smells good. I'm not sure if it's going to work good, but this is just the damage repair conditioner. I don't really like to have shampoo and conditioner mixed together. I like them to be separate. So I'm going to go back and get the shampoo. They've had this product for a while, but you get a nice size bottle. And this is more or less to wash like the wigs with. I will try it in my own hair to see how it works, but I'm going to tell Tati to give it a try because she washes her hair more frequently um, and see how this works. So we did get that. Also got some of this foot powder for smelly, stinky feet, medicated, because it's summertime and your feet do, um, do sweat a lot. There are two different ones. This one is the Triple Relief formula. It's medicated, absorbs moisture, relieves itching, controls foot odor. So this is comparable to the Gold Bond. So we shall see how that works out. I don't like smelly feet. So if you have that issue or you just don't, definitely put these in your shoes because it does give like a cooling sensation and your feet smell good. You like good smelling feet right you sprinkle some of this in your shoes next <laughs> um as you guys know i'm going back to new york um so hopefully by the time i leave i love you too sweetheart you will be here for my field trip your field trip is monday yeah on the 16th okay on the 16th oh yeah. oh <laughs> do you have to bring your own lunch no you just have to bring your own money oh so i'll leave you some money okay um, so you do for what? Because we're gonna, I got 115. We're gonna go to McDonald's or Taco Bell to see which okay. kids what they want. All right, I'll leave you with some money then. Okay, so travel size, they have like really great stuff at the Dollar Tree for travel sizes. Because you know, when you get on a plane, you definitely have to have the right size, especially if you only have an overhead bag. And it does have the little plane indicator here that says that it's plain travel safe friendly. So this is ivory soap. And this one smells really good. You can get like the big, big size one at Walmart for 98 cents. So for a dollar, you're getting a smaller version, but it's all good. You know, I try to get as much travel size stuff as I can. Also, it's still good to have these around the house. Even if you're not traveling, these are really great for if you got a guest that comes over. And I also did get this, and this is the Palmer's Cocoa Butter. These are also travel friendly, and these are 1.7 fluid ounces. And I love these. These heals, softens, 24 hour moisture. You know what I'm saying? Daily skin with therapy. She's already lotioned up for prior to this because she knows. So yes, this is the Palmer's brand, okay? Hope you guys can see that this is the Palmer's brand. What do you think about the lotion? Next. Okay. So also for the travel size, I did get these little containers. These oh, are cute. I took something out of that. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, I needed it. These are cute. I'm going to put my hair gels in these. They're travel size. I'm going to put my hair gel in it on one and like my facial scrub in the other. You know what I'm saying? She just be hating. Wait, Three of them. just on the plane? No. I need oh, this for me. I thought you were going to be on the plane with your teeth brush just fixing your baby hairs. <laughs> If I needed to, but dang, no, because if, if you, anyway. <laughs> also, I did get these. I've never seen these at the Dollar Tree before. This is by the checkout counter. These eyebrow and bikini line trimmers. No, you either. They come with three. These have the safeguards on them. I did use one to cut the baby hairs of my wig, actually. This wig that I'm wearing from RPG Show. I do have a video up on that. And huh? you're still Ariel. And I'm still talking. Mumsy says I look like Ariel from Little Mermaid. The other day I was who? Elsa. Elsa from Frozen because my hair was that color and the way I had it braided. And then prior to that, I was um, the little girl from the movie Brave, the Disney movie Brave. What is her name again? Merida. Merida. Okay, so I am like every Disney character to her, okay? Like, I think she's going to be Cinderella. Cinderella. What color is her hair? Dark? It's blonde. Oh. Got a blonde wig, girl. Got a blonde one. So I'm going to be Cinderella. Travel size, friendly, intimate, 
feminine wipes so you can put these in your purse. Girl, make sure you carry these with you. Young girls, little girls, womanly girls, whatever. This is always to make your stuff smell fresh. These come with 16 in a package. You can also get the ones that are in the actual, like, like a baby wipe thing. They good, girl. I love them. And then last, well, not last, but some washcloths. I like these ones. These are the microfiber washcloths. They come with three in a pack. I like those. They come in different colors, beige, blue, and white. But the last but not least is something from my buddy right here. They got some new Legos. The Legos. Oh, yeah. Forgot all about that, huh? I don't know it was makeup, like a no. makeup starter kit. Yeah, no. It says comparable to Lego brand. No, it doesn't say that. It just says compatible with other leading sets. So this is the My World 25 Pieces Legos or, you know, something like that. So this is the 25 My World, 25 Pieces My World. And this is a dresser and a desk. And it's just like Legos. They have like different versions of these at the Dollar Tree. Mumsy loves Legos. So for a dollar, hey, for a dollar, make me holler. Make me holler. Yes, yeah, so if your kids like Legos, you can definitely check those out at the Dollar Tree. All right, you guys, so that was it for our Dollar Tree haul. We hope you guys enjoyed it for the month of April. We will be back soon to share some other goodies with you guys, like treat boxes that we just got sent. Hopefully, they're not nasty, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully they're not nasty. So make sure you guys follow Mumsy on YouTube at Mumsy's World and her Instagram. I'll make sure to post everything below for you guys. So that way you can show her some love. Oh, look at my nail. It's broken. Oh. I'm trying so hard to grow my little nails out, but oh well. So I love you guys. Stay deep and be delicious. Make sure you rate. You ain't supposed to be. She all into the Lego thing. Just looking at it. We love you guys. I love you guys. Say goodbye. Dang, girl. <laughs> we love you guys. And as always, for a dollar. Make me holla. Make me holla. And we'll see you guys in a soon to come video. Bye. Bye.